As I read this question, I find it curious that in the years 1990, 1991, 1992, and 1993, exactly the same number of bicycles was sold each of those years. It's, it's always X in, uh, in Western Europe. So there was no deviation in uh, the number of bicycles sold each year. Very curious, uh, not realistic, I think. Uh, but then we're told that uh, the share of the market that the domestic producers had dropped from 42% of the total market to 33% of the total market. Now, this would have been a much more complicated question if the size of the market was changing from year to year. But because exactly the same number of bicycles was sold each year, the size of the market remained the same. So the 42% and the 33% are percents out of exactly the same total. In this case, that total is X. So that makes this a lot easier to solve because if the percents are out of the same thing, then we can just look at the difference between 42 and 33 and say they lost 9%. Well, we know they lost 9% of their market share, but since the market hasn't changed, they just lost 9% of X. So that's the answer. The answer is 9% of X. If you like this approach, be sure to check out my book. It's all in there. What do you want me to talk about in my next video? Type it down in the comments below and maybe I'll make a video just for you. Make sure you're subscribed and click that little bell icon below so you don't miss any future videos. See you next time.